Let's take a look at Credential Manager. Credential Manager is the secure storage and usage of user credentials. Named credentials may be selected and used instead of direct use of usernames and passwords. Named credentials are used by Window Maker, Window Viewer, and external applications in apps, controls, and scripting. For cybersecurity protection, named credentials do not store credentials in the InTouch application folder, and credentials are not loaded into process memory. Named credentials are shared by all InTouch applications on the node. Named credentials can be exported and imported. During export and import of an InTouch application, a secret key is used to encrypt named credentials. Let's take a look at the concept behind Credential Manager. OS users belong to groups in Windows or Active Directory. In Credential Manager, OS groups are given a name and associated credentials, which includes the user, the password, and an optional domain. In Window Maker, you use the name credentials when configuring access to the different InTouch HMI components, such as apps, controls, and scripts. At runtime, Window Viewer is run under the OS user logged into Windows. Then each component of the application will use its configured name credentials as long as the OS user belongs to a group that is associated with that named credential. Let's take a look at the software. From Application Manager's Tools menu, I will launch the Credential Manager. The Credential Manager has two parts, the Named Credentials table, where each row is an individual credential with its username and password and the group that has access. And the second part is the details for each selected named credential. Depending on the type selected in the table, you may have domain information, username, password, and the ability to confirm the password that was used. Additionally, at the bottom of the credential manager is an import and export option to import and export users from the table. Wherever named credentials are supported, the dialog box shows the option. For example, here in the alarm client control. In the graphic editor, I'm going to double click, and from this first select from the client mode list, one of the three historical options, which then gives me access to configure credentials. If I select the Windows account option from authentication mode, a credentials drop down list appears where I can then select an existing named credential. It then fills in the domain username and password for me or I can choose SQL Server directly, same story. From here, I can then select an available credential from the Credential Manager. This function allows you to use a named credential, and I'll be logged on using the named credential. And I'm logged on as the student account, which was linked to the named credential in Touch Access. Credential Manager can also be accessed from the install folder for InTouch with these external alarm utilities, alarm DB logger manager, alarm DB purge archive, and alarm DB restore. From here, you have the credentials dropdown list where you can select an available credential.